La Salette Shrine in Attleboro is not letting the pandemic get in the way of their annual celebration, but those taking in the lights this year will see some changes when they visit the shrine. 12 News reporter Rob Nesbitt is live there to explain what we can expect. Rob, sounds like you got the fun assignment of the night. <laughs> Sheena, although La Salette Shrine will still be flipping the on switch to turn on the more than 600,000 lights that are on display here, organizers have changed things a bit because of the coronavirus. No one is allowed on the grounds without a face mask, and everyone walking around to look at the many light displays will need to adhere to the six feet social distancing mandate that's in place in Massachusetts. The occupancy will be monitored by staff at every facility to keep crowd size low indoors. There are also parking restrictions, so drivers will need to be mindful of that as they arrive. The La Salette missionaries felt strongly this year about continuing the tradition that started in 1953. They say the illumination is a sign of hope in these times of loss, stress, and anxiety. The display will be here until January 3rd, and the lights will be turned off each night at 9 p.m. to adhere to the state's curfew of 10 p.m. Live in Attleboro, I'm Rob Nesbitt, 12 News.